Welcome back to my channel, Teresa Love here. Thank you so much for clicking, it means so much. And if you could subscribe, I would love for you to join the family. And if you've also liked to like this video. So today I thought I would do a craft haul or a Joann's haul. I love crafts, I just love making stuff. It's very therapeutic and super fun. So I thought the products that I bought at Joann's, I would share them and talk a little bit about them. All right, let's get into the video. The first product that just came out is this unique technique from Tim Holtz, and it's a stamp platform. This is awesome. I will open it up so you can see it. So as a avid scrapbooker, I make cards and I scrapbook, and when you stamp, you stamp once and then maybe the color is not dark enough. So you want to stamp it again. But to line it up exactly in the exact same spot that you put it last time is like almost impossible. So you tend to get like a double stamp look, which doesn't look right and doesn't look professional. So Tim Holtz just came out with this stamp platform. It's this little platform that has grids on it so you can line up your stamp and you put your card you put your card here and you nail it down with this magnet. And so if you have your card right here, and then you put your stamp here, clear stamps only, not the rubber ones that you had with the wood, but you put it on here. Then as soon as you close it, it goes in the exact spot that your the magnets are of your paper. So when you stamp, it lines up your stamp perfectly. And this is something that any scrapbooker or card maker would totally want. I think it was $30 at Joann's and it's definitely worth it. The next things that I got are more of a technique. These are also from Tim Holtz. I just love his products at Michael's and Joann's. These are called the Tim Holtz Distress Inks. And a really awesome thing about these products is you can do techniques. So like this is a picture that I just saw on Instagram and it's a mermaid card but the blue is kind of like sponged almost and that's the look that you'll get when you use these distressed inks. I am so excited to try a card and just to play with them so much. So they're mini. These are the, the distressed inks mini just very small. And real quickly, I'll just go through the names. This is the Abandoned Coral, Cracked Pistachio, Fossilized Amber, Worn Lipstick, Black Soot, Mermaid Lagoon, this will be my favorite, Shaded Lilac, it's like a lavender, Vintage Photo, and Pumice Stone. So those are the single ones I bought, and then I bought the sets, which come in four. Dormy Sky, Frayed Burlap, Dried Marigold, and Forest Moss. And another set, and this is the Fried Brick, Mowed Lawn, Salty Ocean, and Seedless Preserves. That's like a purple. And then my last set I got was the Picked Raspberry, Mustard Seed, Peacock Feathers, Spiced Marmalade. And because these are all so little, they actually have a case that comes with it. This is the Mini Distress case and it holds 12. So there's the picture. And they fit perfectly. Just throw some in here for now. See, they just fit beautifully in here. And then easiest part is everything will stay together. Then you may be wondering, how do I use these? So, then you get the mini ink blending tool. This is a stamp type. It is wood on the top and spongy right here. Then it has a little almost stamp holder. Take one of these and you open it and you tap it in. Then when you tap it in, you use it as like you can get different textures and you can do lots of different techniques and amazing things with these. I'm just so excited. What is really cool is you take off the top because it's Velcroed. And then they made this so smart. On the bottom, there's a empty place. 
and you take this and you just push it in. So all of your stuff is together. Then you take it out, put it on the thing. Let's say it already has this blue on, tap it in, and it's all together. Then I also got a bunch of these sponges. So you need one for every color and then they go in the bottom. Can't wait to show you guys a card that I make. I will be doing tutorials coming up, so just be looking out for that. That's the Joann's haul. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!